Welcome to Tuesday's Tips from So Very Easy. My name is Laura, and last week I did a video on what I like to bring on a quilting retreat. Well, I've had a lot of questions about my machine on wheels, so I'm going to answer some of those questions now. The first thing is the suitcase is called a tuto. In Italian, that means complete everything, you're not missing anything, and that's exactly what this suitcase does. It has been designed for sewing machines, so there's a lot of features in it that you're not going to find in another suitcase. The bag comes in different sizes and different colors. I have the large size. I like it even though it's a little bit too big for my machine. I'd rather have it bigger so I can put extra stuff in. Now right now it is in a flat storage position. So it still can stay up right, but it's very thin because what happens is it compresses down so it's great for storage. Then you're going to be able to open it. So I'm going to show you how easy it is to open this bag. On both sides you have these two little clips and it actually says push on it and very simply that's all you need to do. When you push you're going to be able to just take your hand and just pull that top a little bit away. Most times you don't even have to do that. And that's one side and I'm going to push and I can just take and push from both fingers and that's it that's going to unlock it. From there, this bag opens up and I can just pull it open. And you'll see that you have these sidebars. These sidebars are just going to lock and that is going to keep that suitcase in the position that you want. And it's on both sides. So now the suitcase is fully opened. It has four wheels on the bottom, so <laughs> it can move in many, many different directions. There is a handle, and the handle is stored in one of the sides. So while it's in storage, the handle is not going to get in your way. Now, it sort of compresses up at the top, because what it does is it fits in these little holes up at the top. And you're just going to be able to squeeze this handle, put it in one side, and just push a little bit, and it's going to fit right into the other side. And that handle is good and secure. So you can take the handle off the same way. You're just going to squeeze those two ends, and that handle comes off. The bag has pockets on both sides, but on one side, when you open up the pocket, what happens is it exposes the entire bag from the one side so you can access it through both the top and the side. The other side of the bag just opens up and this is where I keep my handle and that way it's not going to bang anything inside. Still has lots of pockets, but it stays closed. But it doesn't open up into the machine. And from the sides, the top and the bottom, it has this frame all the way around so you know your machine is going to be well protected. And when you're done, you're going to be able to fold this up. To fold it up and put it away, you take your handle off and slip it in that pocket that does not open to the inside. To fold it, I find it easier if I lay it on its side. The reason is, is I have two hard bottoms. And these hard bottoms need to be opened up in order for you to collapse the suitcase. So I lay it down on its side. The one bottom is going to flip open to the one side. This one I'm going to be able to keep open to the top. I take this little flap and I undo it and I just pull it inside of the bag. Now I'm going to be able to compress it. And I'm going to be able to push those two buttons to close it. And both those bars are going to collapse. So I need to do that to this side. And I take all of the bag and I push it to the inside, even the bottom. Once all the sides have been pushed in, you can just continue to collapse it. And this handle will just lay flat right along the bottom. There's that extra bottom. I'm going to be able to just lay that down flat now. And I just make sure everything is flat and out of the way. I can zip up that extra side. And as you push, you're going to be able to just lock that together. And if the bag does not want to close, sometimes it could be just this arm is sort of getting in its way. So the one arm, just put it over to the other side. And that way when it's closed, it will be able to lock closed together. And you can see how those two bars nestle up to each other. So I have a very small surface to have to store it. To open it, 
Just hold on to those clips and open the bag. Now the Two Toe Company has the bag in lots of different colors and lots of different sizes. They also have made the bags for other things like a pet carrier and an office on wheels. So you can get it for many different things. It stores flat, it's good and strong, the wheels are beautiful on it, and everything is very well protected inside because of that nice metal frame all the way around. Hopefully that answers all of the questions. And as always, thank you for joining me today on So Very Easy. Feel free to subscribe, and as always, come on back. Let's see what we're sewing next time in the sewing room. Bye for now.